Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. I just wanted to talk a little bit about vacation mode on eBay. So I just came back from vacation and I have to apologize for this lighting because I'm just sitting in my car in front of the post office. But I just came back from being gone for seven days. I went to Playa del Carmen, Mexico, which was absolutely beautiful and amazing. And I got fried, so my nose is peeling. But I decided to put my to not put my store on vacation mode because I've done it in the past and I feel like sales will slow down a little bit. Um, what I did instead was I just changed the handling time. So I typically keep mine on a one day handling time. Some items I'll put at two days handling time depending on what it is and if I know it's going to take me a bit more to get it packed. And so I, what I did was a bulk edit and you just go to all of your listings, click the little box that selects all of your listings and then you change your handling time. So I changed my handling time to 10 days and when I would sell something, then I would just message the customer, message the buyer, and it was just something really short like, hi, thanks so much for your purchase. Um, I'm currently on, or I'm currently out of town, not on vacation. I said, I'm currently out of town and I won't be back until January 31st, so I'll ship your package after that. If you want to cancel, please go ahead and submit it and I will understand, thank you. And I would say, okay, so I have, nine, I think I have 19 packages here in my car I'm dropping off and two of them were Poshmark, which totally blew my mind because I haven't really done anything on Poshmark, but two of them were Poshmark and one of them was Amazon, so the rest were all eBay. And I would message these people and I would say out of the ones that were on eBay, probably a third of the people would message me back and every single one of them was positive and nobody canceled their orders they all just said thanks have fun thanks for letting me know appreciate it no hurry I don't need it right away you know everybody was really cool about it but if I had probably not told the people that I wouldn't ship their items then they would be wondering where their stuff was so I think even though you change your handling time, it's good to message your buyer and let them know what the situation is so they're not sitting there staring at their mailbox waiting for it to arrive. And, um, <clears throat> excuse me. And th the thing is, is that eBay doesn't tell people what your handling time is, as far as I know. Um, so you just need to be proactive in that area. And if you do set your stuff on vacation mode, this is also what I understand. Your sales will kind of slow down. I don't know if they get pushed to the bottom. Your listings will get pushed to the bottom. Um, or if it just slows, I, I don't know. Some people have said that it just slows it down and they don't get as many sales. But I had like two sales every day, which is good for me. I mean, I have like 300 and, oh, I think I'm... I don't know. I have like 300 items listed, so not a lot. I try to get it up and I go through phases and then it drops back down. So anyhow, I'm really happy with the sales that I got. Um, the only one that concerned me was my Poshmark because the lady that ordered it from me needs this item for a wedding in Mexico and I'm shipping it today. So she's actually going to get it on Monday and she'll be really happy because she's leaving on Wednesday. So just communicate with your buyers and uh, oh the other thing I was going to mention about vacation mode is if you put that notice on it will tell your customer or anybody who's looking at your item that you are away until whichever date you selected so I would kind of think that some people wouldn't buy your item if you're selling something that's similar to what they can get from anybody else. If it's not one of a kind item, then they're probably going to go to the person that can ship it right away. But if they chose you because of your feedback or whatever reason, your location, then, you know, maybe it's, it's just good to communicate with them. Maybe they either they will buy it from you or they won't buy it from you. You just have to tell them what is going on. So 
anyhow, that's what I did and I came home and yeah, I mean, I have a lot of packages that I had to set up, but I'm very happy about it. So I will, <clears throat> I am losing my voice right now. Um, I'll take a picture of, or flip the camera, I guess, and show you guys my packages. Show you my package. Don't get a dirty mind. <laughs> That's kind of weird. Okay. Um, thanks for watching, everybody. Leave a comment down below if, you know, what has worked for you or what hasn't worked for you. And don't forget to like this video if you liked it or give me a thumbs down if you hated it. Whatever. It's all the same. Thanks, guys. Talk to you later. Those are my packages.